Wenda Johnson, man, she is known as a great horsewoman. She got to go around and win 13.57. She yeah. has two horses she can throw at you. Yeah, she does. And, you know, she'll probably ride them both before this week's done. But right now, Mo stole the show tonight. Man, oh, man, what a run. And she wins the first race. Back, Kaylee Kinzel hit a barrel in the first round. Everybody was surprised. What's she doing round number two? Now yeah, she wins at 13.61. Yeah, and what she say now, she's won every round at the NFR. She and sister have. So that is so awesome to win round number two in a great way. Look out now. Haley Kinsel caught a barrel in round one. She's won the last two rounds now. Man, look out. You know, when you see sister coming around that first barrel and driving out of there so hard, the win last night, she just gets faster and faster as the week goes along. Remember, she was 13-11 in this building before, so she is something. Barrel racing team has probably been the fastest without picking up a check. Emily Bysol, they've been uh, in Chongo. They've kind of knocked down a few barrels. They left them up tonight, and they were untouchable. Yeah, they were knocking down barrels to win goal rounds. That's how fast chongo has been running. Emily figured it out and wins the round. All-time great scoring as you wound up with Lisa Lockhart and Haley Kinzel, both with times of 13.52. Yeah, Lisa Lockhart, she's such a crowd favorite in this building. She's been here so many times on so many different horses. Levy, this is her young horse. What a run they put together. And to tie this one, you know you've got a good horse. This is Sister and Haley. What a run they put together as well. I love this mare. Yeah, they came up late in the batting order. Didn't match it. Didn't matter. They still matched that, that time there. That was pretty incredible. 13.52. Second place. <laughs> a tenth off the arena record. Another dead heat in barrel racing. Brittany Posey Tanazi. She was out early. She put up 13.57. Yeah, when you watch this run, you know, the second I saw it, I knew it was going to be so fast. What a flawless run. Every turn was absolutely perfect. Birdie really was good, but how good has Chongo been when he can leave the barrels up? You can tell that Emily, he's been a handful just to, to keep in hand, but man, he got it done, 13.57. They came up late in the, in the draw. Yeah, second to the last girl out, so low on the ground, but they raked the queen every barrel race. Time seven man. and one. So Jordan Briggs has trouble. Lisa Lockhart has trouble. Wenda Johnson now moves to the driver's seat. Yeah, she and her great horse, Mo. That was a super run, really close on that first barrel, but she knew she had an opportunity. Boy, she looks like she is going to be tough to stop. Small ago, first cowgirl out in barrel racing. 1341, fastest time we've seen this week. If you're number one in the average, it seems like you're cursed. This world championship up for grabs. Yeah, it certainly is, but what a run by Leslie right here. I mean, that was her best run of the week, the fastest run we've seen in the week. Kind of a strange round, and Caleb Schmidt took a big step toward winning that world title. Haley Kinzel, she's back in the average. She's number one in the world. She wins the round. Her world championship hopes for maybe a fourth gold buckle are very much alive. Yeah, and what impressed me, flipped the reins on Haley Kinzel usually is very strong in the average. This year she hit two barrels, she was out of it, and she just rock and rolled on the last two rounds and wound up as a four-time world champion. Yeah, she insisted they just got faster and faster and faster. One one hunter was second. They had to fight to hold on to win the world title. They did. Zeke Thurston also wins that Ram Top Gun Award. Uh, just a shade under.